Okay, today I'm going to show you the seven stroke roll. So this just follows the same as the six stroke, the five stroke. It's using 16th double stroke notes, 16th notes and an eighth note to accent. So the eighth note is always the accent and the 16th doubles or diddles, whatever you want to call them, right, left, right, 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 left, left, right, right, left, left. The total would add up to seven, so it would be six, right, right, left, left, right, right, left, left, and then one uh, accent eighth note. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right, left, right, right, left, left, right, right, left, right, right, left, left, right, right, left, 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 right. Sorry, messed that one up. Let me go back over it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right, right, left, left, right, right, left. So the, if you're starting with the right, with the right, you're going to end with the left. If you're starting with the left, you're going to end with the right accent. So left, left, right, right, left, left, right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So let's, uh, you know, I, we could do either one. It just depends on where you're on. And when I use a drum set, I use, specifically doing fills. You know, it depends on where I want to end the accent. That's where I'm going to start. So uh, let's do a real slow just to kind of go over it on a you know, real slow because that's where you're going to start. And then we'll build it up to a speed where I can use it as a fill and kind of show you how the accents are going to end. And depending on where you want to end the accent, that's where you're going to start the, the diddles or the double notes. So it's right, I'm going to start with the right because that's what most people are right handed. Right, right, left, left, right. Right, left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right, right, left, left, right, right, left. Right, right, left, left, right, right, left. Now on the snare. Right, right, left. Now I'll do it at a, a, a quicker speed. So we'll just speed. We'll start it slow and we'll build it to the speed. Let's do a little bit faster. Right, right, left, 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 so you get the drift. Let's start with the other hand. We'll go left, left, right, right, left, left, right. Left, left, right, right, left, left. Right. Now you're in it on the right hand. Left, left, right, left, 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 right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three. Either way. See, if you're doing a fill, you might want to end on the right just to do a real heavy crash. Like that. Or the other one, you want to do the hi hat. And it's probably a good exercise to do to alternate, just like when we were doing the five stroke, but doing the seven stroke, you can alternate. So, right, left, left. Yeah, I'm going right, left, right, left. Uh, so it doesn't matter if you want to just do the accent on the right. If you feel comfortable just doing the right, do that and then practice the other one for a couple days. Now we're trying. Since I'm left hand weak, I would go with it, probably do uh, more practicing with the left. So left to right. Yeah, and with fills, it's you know just like all the others, you just find your niche where you're at and how it feels, and and after you're practicing these rudiments when you're doing the drum set, try to try to add it into a fill. Now uh, I haven't really even had I haven't practiced any uh, seven stroke rolls in a fill, so I'm gonna try it see what it does. I'll try it with the jazz first since uh, I always seem to it seems to me like fills. For me, uh, doing jazz, I get a lot more I'm a lot more comfortable doing fills with jazz than rock. I don't know why. It's just kind of probably because I started out with jazz. And it just seems easier. And it seems like jazz is more syncopated and there's more opportunity for fills 
uh, where a rock you just want to keep the time most of the time you're not really doing a lot of fills so uh, do a little jazz and see if I can stick in a seven stroke roll either right or left I could probably come up with even more ideas with the seven stroke roll. It has that really cool off and a lot of jazz has that that kind of thing. So I could see where it would be really nice. sequence. So every time I show something I'm learning uh, myself. So I'm kind of just at the same stage right now. I feel like a beginner learning these rudiments over since I haven't done them in years. I'm just so used to using them automatically. When you go back and study them again it really forces you to learn at a different level and it gives you more strength when you approach the drums for the second time. Um, I'm always, even as old as I am, has been playing for years I still take lessons whenever I can, you know, and I, you know, because it really helps. It's always good to take lessons uh, or watch people on YouTube uh, doing that. So, as I'm teaching this, I'm learning just like, you know, someone is a student. So uh, the seven-stroke roll is is, uh, is a great. I didn't try rock. Let's try rock and see if I can even uh, attempt to do. Uh, since it feels so jazzy, I want to see if it works with rock. It's not as easy, for me it doesn't feel as, as natural as a five stroke or the six stroke. It's kind of off, but I like it with the jazz better than with the rock. It doesn't seem to fit with rock. Maybe in metal, I don't know, uh, or punk. Or maybe polka. No, that doesn't seem to fit with it. I'm sure it fits somewhere if you just work with it. Experimenting more 
with this, and maybe I'll show you some other ideas. But I kind of like the way it works with the hi hat. So if you keep it four on the floor. It gives it a good good feel. Maybe we do it with that. show you some other different things, some clams and clamadiddles and things that I've learned next uh, next video. So thanks for watching. <laughs>